Teachers across the province, many dressed in black, are furious. Collective bargaining uh, rights are gone and we want them back. And more importantly for many students, canceling extracurricular activities. Look what teachers did today, they got up and left. Like, I'm supposed to be at rugby practice. Touring George Brown College, Premier McGinty said teachers shouldn't drag students into this dispute. We're in a bit of a rough patch right now. I understand that. As I say, I can even accept that. Uh, but what I can't accept would be any decision on the part of teachers to withdraw services. Union leaders representing 190,000 teachers vowed their members would withdraw from voluntary activities after a new contract was imposed on them. The Minister of Education signaling the government has the power to step in if things escalate. Putting Students First legislation has within it tools to respond to provincial work to rule uh, circumstances. It is too early uh, to tell. Union leaders say they're within their rights. That's, that's a voluntary activity. That's something they choose to do or not do. So there's no violation of, of any kind of uh, legislation. As a comfort to teachers and a warning to other public sector employees, the Premier offered this. Some, some, some of the teachers see themselves as kind of being um, um, in this kind of on their own. The fact of the matter is that we're all in this together. A way of signaling to the broader public sector that everyone's wages will be frozen, either by negotiation or failing that, with legislation just like for Ontario teachers. Finance Minister not unveiling how that legislation would work, but the Premier indicating that he'd be looking at across the board a single piece of legislation for the broader public service. Now, as for the confusion for parents and teachers today, if you're in high school, a high school student, or you have a kid in high school, uh, teachers should be going back to extracurricular activities tomorrow. For elementary teachers, well, that's more of an ongoing thing with it up to the individual teacher themselves. Clear as mud, I know, Anne.